I'm Johnny Skip Peak. Time for redemption at the Pittsburgh Sprints. Let's do it. One of the attractions here at the Pittsburgh Sprints this year, we got Todd. Our 400 cubic inches of Chevy Muscle. And in the background, we have Handful. And we got Psycho Park. Ready for some demo run! Alright, yeah, my boy's excited. Right, as another attraction, we have the drifters here. Also doing demonstrations. And that is more cars this year. So, this stage will be alternating between Handful, Titan Psychopath, and the drifters. So, I'll have that little demo run soon. Well, we got a Sylvia, another Sylvia. Tracer, Sylvia, and Tracer. Looks like this piece, red base here, has got some American muscle in it. Ah, that'd be interesting. Oh, we got handful at the starting line there. And we got, whoa, look at that, that was Blakey. Doing the last set of runs uh, for the first ones. Let me rephrase that. <clears throat> Just the last of the first run of the day. And we're about to have handful coming and Todd going heading off. Don't forget to support these people, and there's also a food bounty right down the other end. Go handful! Right, we got Todd coming through from turn five. Here we go. Zoom out a bit. Yeah, so, but you'll see Psycho Path at the Burnout Comp later tonight. Here we go. Here comes Tub. Robert Smiley sending it. You! House kid.
He's pretty much on the wires there now. After that run. Hey, he's gonna finish him off. Finish him! <laughs> We got Robert Smiley here. Oh, look at that. Smoke's still coming out of the tub. Out of the tray. I think that's why. Is that why it's called a tub? <laughs> yeah. Mini tub, yeah. 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 All good. So, Robert, thanks for coming out and letting us do this. No. Let you do this. So, Very good. Yep. Love coming here. Always come back to the old stomping grounds. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you've even raced here before in a. Uh, Commodore Ute too. Well, this used to race too. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Days, yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's right. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So, yep. Very good. Mm. Yeah, it's always good to see this out in the out there on the track there, having fun. Yeah, yeah, fun, yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. I mean, certainly come a long way from it's back in the day. So. Evolved, yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah. Ah, it's awesome. Right. Yeah. Thanks for that. No awesome. <laughs> Shiny, she's a bit dusty at the moment. That's a whole lot of motor. 598 cubic inches. Gorgeous, gorgeous rig. The last time I remember this was a 355 stroke or a 400 at one time. But yeah, some money has been well spent on this. Yeah, I might be a bit close. I'll zoom out. Yeah, it's a bit better. Gorgeous machine. You'll see plenty more of that at the Pittsburgh Sprints this weekend. And for all you old school Ford fans, got a couple of old Falcons here. And, um,. Lockie Fowler's here, that's a 351 Clevo. This little beast of um, Chuck Fowler. It's a, I believe, a 5 litre. So it, that's a Ford motor, so like a 302 Windsor. They've just gone and put a carb set up on that, got rid of the injection. So yeah. Uh, actually, no, that might be the, that's Boyce, sorry. I'm saying it's Boyce's car. Um, Dennis Boyce, Lockie Boyce, his son, has got a six, uh, six on a four litre in that. Got the old Kendall mobile over here, double entered. So you got Chris Kendall, he's actually 115, and his old man, Glenn, in, he's number 37, so he'll be coming out shortly. They're about to do the second run at the moment. Little Hyundai, Escorts, there's all sorts of machines around in here. And then I'll show you some more later on down the track. And this is where I'm stationed at the moment. No, I'm not racing because how it's got a bent chassis. So I'm out here just for the burnouts, but I'm also here to support everyone else. She looks a bit rough, but I made it. She's all been tacked in. I'm just going to go get me numbers later on. And also on display, I'll put out this part here that got damaged from last year. So just a couple of examples, that's the old nose cone, she's a little bit rusty because it's been out in the weather. Alright, that's the old passenger guard, that cop around a bit on that corner when I hit one concrete barrier. The old radiator, pop that out, that's where the chassis went through. And that's from a thermo fan that I had sitting on there. But yeah, that's my little setup here at the moment. So, burnouts are on tonight, Saturday night, so I'll be getting ready. <laughs> That's me boy. He's keen for it. You know I am since my first party. Yeah, yeah, we had a little sneaky skid, uh, test skid at a mate's property there the other night, so. Yeah, took him for a run, he absolutely loved it. So, yeah. Yep, definitely, definitely. And check this out. 
I have not taken this wheel off at all from the accident last year. That is from where the um, yeah the concrete barrier. Look closely inside. You might be able to see some concrete still embedded in there. Oh, I see a con. Oh, I see a piece of concrete. Yes. So she's a little bit scuffed, but that's still holding there. It's good enough for me. So, so I found another bumper. Put that on. Yeah, mate. I'm surprised how that, that light has survived. If I can get another one, because the lights work. That light works still. The whole wiring harness works and everything. So, meet. All right, we're heading down towards turn three down the back here. Yeah, Benny Parker getting ready out for his next run. Just about to start run two now. Got the old fours here. Hey, Lachlan, just out of the way. Move back, move back, mate. We've got the old Jaguar coming through. Yeah, that's a burnout car, head shaker. Check out this old Falcon E XG. Yo, in tech in here at the moment, but this thing goes all right too for what it is. It goes quite well. A little tight MR2. Oh, race back. Yours? Yeah. <laughs> Piece of junk. <laughs> in the first run. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, that's why you always got to take it steady. Yeah, oh, I was. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's what's set up inside it? It's got a little 4AG twin charge in it. Ooh, twin charge. Yeah. So super and turbo. Yeah, yeah, yeah turbo feeds the supercharger. Nice. Yeah, supercharger just comes with a multiplier and it just puts out massive amounts of boost. <laughs> So what, what's the, the horsepower at the moment? I've got no idea. I have a shag, I'm not saving up to build a new one. It's, oh, right. It's been cooked a few times, it compresses the cooling system, blows all the cooling out under pressure. <laughs> so I just keep starting and going, so I keep racing it. But um, it runs 28. It's tired, you can't kill them. Nah, mate, 4 AG. Ooh, yeah. I love them. They're pretty much the big block of the four cylinders, aren't they? Nah, nah, they're only 1.6 litre. Yeah, but they're the big block of the four cylinder, or is that the two litre? Oh, you get the two litre at no, 1.8. No. You get bloody, um, I think, I think the old Sigma is the big block of the two litres because they're at 2.6. Oh, wow. Four cylinders, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, the old Sigma's had a 2.6 litre out. Mmm. Yeah, these are just a baby. Well, they go a lot of the show shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> good motors. Yeah, they go a lot of the clappers. They love a bit of boost. <laughs> oh, yeah. Twin charge. I've got to see it. I've got to, can I, is it all right to pop yeah. the bonnet? Yeah. I've just got to see this. It's just... You see, I see it around on the track all the time, and yeah. Yeah, one day I'll Damn. actually clean it up and finish it. Oh, oh yeah, I see the turbo over here. Yeah, turbo and then and oh, the there's, there's a supercharger right there. Another big inner cooler in the boot. Oh, I so see you got two. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Two is that a water to air? Yeah, is it? Yeah. Nice. That is awesome. You're crazy what you see around here. Yeah, rear wheel drive, obviously. Yeah, yeah. yeah rear wheel Lots drive. Of yeah, there's the other <laughs> water there. Yeah, battery or your ECU. Yep, yep. That is awesome. That is awesome. Not at all myself. Hey, it's the best way to do it. If you look closely at any of the welds, you'll see what I did. <laughs> yeah, well, I've been in a lot worse. I've got the old HQ over there that's been in the wreck last year. Jeez. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I'm, I've got the strongest chook poo world around, I reckon. Alright, we're at turns two, three to four now. Still a bit swirly out there, a bit of dust in that. See, Ample's had some funny. Master 3. You can get the grip down and get a good run. Oh 
Bill Datsun. A bit slippery up in that turn four. BABF. Buddy, high horsepower car. Kanda XL. One of the many cheap ways to have fun around here. That goes like a cut snake, that one. Hey, Fowler coming through. Running a heck of a lot better this year than it was last year. Here comes Chuck. Still a bit of tuning needed on her, but she's getting there. Here comes Benny. Oh no, it's not Benny, sorry. Second driver, I'm not too sure who it is. That car has been a regular occurrence there, eh? from near day dot that one. on Australian not to have a ute. Yeah. Oh, ass! Oh. You're not going to believe what's going to come around this corner. I just said it. Got the anti going. Oh, 
WRC's back, Skoda! Damn! Is so that MR2, the twin charge? Had a little quick video on that there. It doesn't backfire, Lachlan. Got it all, that's it. That's got some boost in it. It does. Yo. Astra. Turbo. Yeah, boosting them. Yeah, Any car has a racing car. Definitely. Sylvia, sponsored by Will's Home. Any worst car, Will have a racing car. More of a drift car, but it goes well. That thing's got a barrel in it too, by the way. Supercharge. Oh, is that the power steering pump? I don't know. Yes, we've got the R35 GTR coming around the corner, Phil Sutcliffe. I thought it he, did, he uh, had some issues last year and uh, he's no longer number one at the moment. Hopefully, if he wins this year, he'll be number one. Some quick evos about. Find them, grind them. Another part of the entertainment for this year. Same as last year. Yeah, so here we go, here we go. Bob with the red one. Can he make it this time? And he does it! Oh no, over rotation! <laughs> so buddy, what do you think of that so far? Yeah, sweet! <laughs> yeah, those drifters, are, they've got some talent, that's for sure. Yeah. And handful. And tub. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed that little video there at the moment. Um, it's about 11 o'clock and that at the moment on Saturday. He's got soccer to go to. I've got to take him out there and I'll be back in time for the burnouts. And that hopefully a bit more, so we'll see. So, see how we go with the footage and all that, and I'll hash something together. Right, at this stage, see you around the smoke zone.